Hi guys, Dean from the Bush Company here. Now, as you can see from behind me on the shelf, the Bush Company has a wide range of recovery equipment. And one of the products that we often overlook is a air jack. Now, these air jacks are absolutely great, but basically I want to discuss where we use them. So in places where a high lift jack, for example, or a bottle jack, or another form of recovery equipment can't be used, maybe we want to get a wheel directly out of a rut or change a tire on a, on a vehicle in a very sandy or muddy or boggy situation. An air jack is a great recovery device in those situations. So up on the beach, down a mud track, for example. Now, the air jacks that we have have got this really decent grab handle on the bags themselves. And this is a waterproof dry bag. In other words, when the jack itself is full of mud maybe and sand, you can store it inside the bag, roll it up, clip it together, and that is gonna allow all the water, all the mud and sand to stay in the bag and not dirty or mess up the rear of your vehicle. So running through the jack itself, the most important part on our air jacks is that we've got a twin inflation system. So as you can see over there, we've got an inflation on this end over here. That is your exhaust jack inflation. Now there's many of these air jacks on the market um, and most of them attach just with the exhaust side where we've got the benefit of two. So your standard compressor is a perfect example. Plugs into your standard tire valve will inflate this whole jack up as well. Um, that's just allowing, in case your exhaust isn't working, for example, the air compressor can be used. Now, these jacks themselves are roughly 500 mils wide and blow up to roughly 800 mils high. So even if you have that 35 inch lifted vehicle, you'll be absolutely great, be able to put that underneath the chassis and lift the vehicle. Included in the kit comes the long air hose or exa exhaust extension hose. So basically that cone over there is gonna go and plug straight into the rear of your exhaust and that's gonna allow us to inflate the jack. And then we also have these protection pads. Now these pads, basically you place one pad underneath the jack itself and place the other pad between the jack and the vehicle. So it's just gonna protect the air jack itself from any of those sharp points under the vehicle. Maybe a bolt, maybe an old rusty chassis rail, for example. So as you can see guys, here's a demo and um, clearly those pads being on top and underneath the air jack, that's gonna protect us against the sharp bolts in the bottom of the U-bolts on the suspension. Now, in this video, we are jacking up a 60 series Toyota Land Cruiser and you know, fully loaded, roughly about 2.6 tons. We decided to use a standard four-wheel drive air compressor for this, so basically the one that you would plug into your six socket outlet on your vehicle, um, same one you use to pump your tires. And this total process took roughly about eight minutes, um, but we've just sped it up for you. Now, the big thing to notice is the large surface contact area of the jack on the vehicle. That's gonna allow for safe and secure jacking. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that review on the Bush Company Air Jack. Now, you know, they're not the most common used piece of recovery device, but let me tell you something. If you're on Fraser Island and you've got the incoming tide coming in, or up in the high country and you need to get out of some really deep ruts, these are absolutely great bit of kit to just have a spare. So for more information on this product, go to www.thebushcompany.com.au. Catch you later.